ahead of the Semicon India 2025 conference, Syncare President and CEO Chris Ripley praised India's growing influence in semiconductor design and wireless technologies. He said, India is leapfrogging the rest of the world in these critical sectors and highlighted a tablet powered by a D2M chief design in India as a prime example. He noted that India's engineering expertise is second to none, which has led to significant investments from global players like Sinclair. Hi, I'm Chris Ripley, President and CEO of Sinclair, one of the largest broadcasters here in the US. And we recognized that the expertise available in India was second to none in the world, and we've invested heavily in India to produce next generation wireless technologies like what I have in my hand here. This is a tablet powered by a D2M chip designed in India. And a great example about how India is leapfrogging the rest of the world in critical wireless technologies and semiconductor design and driving innovation and new products in the U.S. and the rest of the world. Prime Minister Narendra Modi inaugurated the three-day flagship event on Tuesday at Yashubhumi, New Delhi. The conference focused on building a resilient and sustainable semiconductor ecosystem in India. PM Modi also participated in a CEO's roundtable to engage with industry leaders. Semicon India 2025 will feature over 20,750 participants, including 2,500 international delegates from 48-plus countries, 150 plus speakers and more than 350 exhibitors. Key topics include the progress of India's semiconductor mission, fabrication and advanced packaging projects, smart manufacturing, AI, R&D and startup support through the design-linked incentive scheme. This is the fourth edition of the Semicon India series with previous conferences held in Bengaluru, Gandhinagar and Greater Noida, aligning with India's vision to become a global semiconductor hub.